Hello everyone and welcome to another Banjo Kazooie Let's Play with my friend. Say your name. <laughs> <laughs> Calham64. Hello guys. Yeah, welcome back to more. Uh, Harry plays Banjo Kazooie and I guide him through it for help and stuff like that. Yes. And I am obviously Banjo and he's gonna be my Kazooie. Oh yeah, we're usual. still doing this, are we? Yeah, yes. yeah. Bloody well, because... in the icon, you, you, I basically made him so it looked like I, I made a version of us <laughs> as Banjo and Kazooie in the icon. Exactly. <laughs> so. So do you remember where you're going? Nope. You don't. <laughs> well, brilliant. Okay. <laughs> I think it's this way though. Mm-hmm. And it then is. I do. No, 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 no. Not I think it's one this right one. There. No, I'm wrong, I'm wrong, I'm wrong. I'm just remembering controls mm -hmm. quickly. For the record, guys, I, I know what he's supposed to be doing pretty much all the time, but it's fun to just see how he finds it out <laughs> himself, <laughs> as you can see right there. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> Amused by poop, are you? Brilliant. Yes. <laughs> he, he pooped out an egg. Oh, great. Hello, sir. Yes, I got the 50 notes. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because uh, did we see this before? I can't actually remember. It's been a while since we recorded. Uh, I don't think so. It's a similar thing with Metro Prime, where I recorded the first episode in November, and then the second one I recorded in like January. <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> it was uh, it was a bit of a while because it took a while to get the series going because life. Yeah. <laughs> but you know. Uni and stuff. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I wonder if I'll actually finish Moonin. <laughs> yeah, let's see. <laughs> the amount of stuff that's been unfinished. <laughs> yes. Then again, I have a I have an actual uh, unfinished project on my channel, don't I? Yeah, I don't remember what... Uh, it's... Let's see if you can remember. <laughs> uh, Mario v Donkey Kong. Yep, that's right. With the toy Marios for some reason. Yeah, that's right. Oh, that door was easy. You got past. Unfortunately... You're first and last. Okay. Oh, God, she's saying nothing. I've got this card. Oh, God. So when I'm thinner, it really makes me look like a winner. Uh, oh, sorry, I... like a winner. <laughs> okay, so let's turn the camera so I can actually see. Mm -hmm. Oh, by the way, one thing I'd recommend uh, for you to do, uh, well, you can go to that first if you want. Uh, you want to talk to somebody in this room. Okay, I'll find the person. Mm hmm I'll see if you can find it. Like, even though I'm telling him what to do, I'm not going to tell him exactly uh, where yeah. to go. Ah, is this it? Kazooie, yeah. shoot a disc and find me. I'll tell you how to use it. That was uh, Bottles just telling you about an ability. Yes. I think I've got to go up here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, I see her. Yeah, you want to go I, I actually remember that from the first time, but for some reason I forgot about her. Oh, I see. Hello there, young ones. I'm Bruntilda, <laughs> Gruntilda's nicer sister. I've crept down here to help you defeat the old hag. It's about time she was taught a <laughs> lesson. The text. I know all of Grunty's disgusting secrets, and I'll tell you three of them every time you find me. <laughs> Remember them well, young ones as they will help you avoid a fiery fate. Keep note of that. Press B if you'd like to hear them. All right, so you wanna hear one of them. Grunty brushes her rotten teeth with tuna ice cream flavored toothpaste. <laughs> Very. You wanna click it again though, you wanna do this three times, okay? Yeah. She also washes her hair with baked beans. <laughs> Yuck. Okay, one more time. Okay. And she gets her clothes from the witch's warehouse. So you'll find that if you press B again, um, she'll say the same thing. You know, Granty brushes her rotten teeth. So you want to click it three times every time you see her. Yeah. And keep note of some of the things that she says. They'll help you out much later in the game. Okay. I was like, why does she tell me all these things? <laughs> I'm not going to say exactly what they're for, but it'll be... You'll get what I mean like later on during it. Yeah. Oh, great. To remove pieces you already have put down, press down C button. But once the picture is complete, all the pieces are stuck there permanently. The reason why I speak like that is because Bottles is annoying. He is annoying. <laughs> He's very in your face a lot. He's a, He's a nice character, though. It's a shame for what happened to him at the beginning of Banjo Tooie. Oh, yeah. I think I remember seeing that in mm. your thing. Yeah. Uh, now, where was that? Uh, blah, blah, blah. 
Oh, hang on. Oh, that's that enemy, isn't it? Yeah. That, Hi! <laughs> I was waiting for you to notice that. I was like, dude, that is not an NPC. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Eggs. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna collect them. <laughs> There's a whole bunch of eggs for you. I'm just like, uh, screw changing the camera. You can look at ugliness. Yeah. Oh. oh, well, yeah, I actually forgot that was there. Good one. <laughs> well, I, just, I just explored and I find things. Yeah, exactly. You found That's it. what I like about this game. You found, uh, what do they call it? They call it a mumbo skull, but I call them Ekan Bokums. Because they go Ekan Bokum. Hmm. Oh, I'm just going to call them Crystal Skulls. I actually forgot the rewind. Grand Tilda was saying there, unfortunately. Sorry. Okay. So, um, do you know what they do? What, this thing? Yeah. No. You'll find out later. You'll have to find another one, though. I think I did read that, like, oh, really? basically. Yeah, at the moment, when you jump Whoa. into it, <laughs> it just launches you out at the minute. Oh, I know what that is. It's a shortcut, isn't it? Y yeah, well done. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty simple to figure out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, good job. I mean, it, it's kind of like that. It makes sense, doesn't it? Because it's a yeah. cauldron, and when you jump into it, it launches you back out, and then suddenly you think, oh, that means there's another one. Maybe if I jump into it, it transports me somewhere else. Yeah. That was uh, like a nutshell of things going through your mind. Uh, <laughs> okay. I was just doing that poorly. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, it's alright. Don't worry. The talent shot takes uh, practice. I'm glad you're doing most of the commentating during this episode. <laughs> so it allows me to concentrate a bit. Yeah, exactly. That was like the whole idea and stuff, really. Okay, right. So, um, do you remember where exactly the thing is? No. Nope. I've got a feeling it's down, though. Am I correct? Uh, yeah. It is down and stuff. The direction you're going in that is uh, for later. But then again, like I said, half the time I might just remain silent because it's fun just watching you try to find stuff out yourself. Yeah. Because like, I'm gonna, I, I'm gonna just take a glimpse into it, but I'm doing it wrong, so <laughs> I might out, fail. You click in there, Z and B. <laughs> yeah. I'm I'm clicking the wrong buttons. Yeah. Remember, so... the A is for jumping. <laughs> the B is for the actions. Yeah. There you go. Mm -hmm. I just wanted to see what's here. That's all. Yep. Hello, future area. Future area. Well, I know it's, I won't need it to the future. I mm -hmm. think the first time I played this, I actually fell down this area and got lost. You got lost? Yeah. All oh, right, okay. So, <laughs> it's okay. I'm not going to do that again. <laughs> Fair enough. Because, I mean, you, don't, you can't really do a lot in there at the minute. There's a certain thing you can do. Um, but it's not worth it because it's needed in order to get to the world in the first place. Yeah, so no point right now. Exactly, so you might as well just do that much later on, depending on, you know, what goes on. I did it wrong. Hey. <laughs> oh, God. It, what? What? <laughs> what the you, heck happened there? You um, kind of got yourself stuck, so that you... You managed to somehow get yourself stuck or so into getting infinitely hit by the enemy. <laughs> I know, I was like, what? Because of the slope. <laughs> yeah, um, just a hint to make it a lot easier. You remember the roll? Rolling is a lot easier for the enemies. Oh, I, I may have opened something. Oh, no, I haven't. It's fine. That was just Gruntilda doing another rhyme telling you about how to open a door. Well, we don't care, so. Yeah, exactly. Okay. I'm just gonna... From time to time, I might also be quiet because I'll be just jamming along to the music. Yep, I'm just gonna fall down. Because you know I love this soundtrack. <laughs> I'm gonna collect uh, some eggs while you jam. Genius. Sorry. I'm gonna collect some eggs while you jam. Mhm. Mm while I jam. Great. Yeah. Brilliant. And uh, don't die, banjo. Mm -hmm. Don't die. There you go. <laughs> okay. Uh. This way. Mm-hmm. There you go. Cool. Oh my god. <laughs> what the heck? I'm trying to collect the eggs and I'm not doing it very efficient at all. Remember what I told you before, if you press the A button and that you can do a sort of light swim to make yeah. it a bit easier. Thank you for reminding me. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> Cause don't worry. I haven't come back to this game in a while, so I don't really remember <laughs> the controls that well. It's kind of my fault, because I've been a bit busy, because I'm the one who owns the game. Yes, so, he owns the game, so I can't play it by, uh, on my own time, but... Exactly, I've, I've owned this game like ever since Halloween 2013. Oh, Grunty's legs and stomach fins, goodbye to all those double chins. I know it's probably not necessary for me to read them, but I just like to. It's fine. Because they're rhyme, and that's what makes Gruntilda so special. You do you. 
<laughs> you do you, and I do I. <laughs> yes. That's one way to say it, I guess. Okay, um, you can try going to that area. Uh... Okay. Also, notice how the music changes depending on where you are, even though it stays with, like, the same sort of tune. Yeah, it's quite nice. Yeah, that's that's one thing I like about the soundtrack for Banjo Kazooie. Um, it stays with like the same tune going on, but depending on which area you are, it alternates it, making it suit the area a lot more. Okay, so, so I'm guessing this is for a later area. Yeah, uh, uh, but there's another one of these. Uh, you can just do that when you come to it later. I'll come to want. it later. I would, because otherwise you're going to have to try to memorize that and... Um, I'd rather write it down at some point. This area that you're in is much, much later, by the way. Wow, I, I do too much exploring sometimes. Yeah, there's a lot of um, um, areas that you find, like, at the beginning, which you can access, which are for much, you know, later on down the lines of the game. That's interesting. I didn't know that about the game the first time I played it. Yeah. <laughs> Am I trapped down here? Hold on. Are you crapped, did you say? No, trapped. Oh, right. I was, I, for some reason, I heard that as crap. I'm like, are you crapped down? <laughs> Am I crapped? Well, so far, you've spent like around 12 minutes and you haven't gone to the next level yet, so... Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, this is my thing. I get lost. Um, it's all right, dude. <laughs> but I do enjoy exploring, so I found the world. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you found it now. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I think... Oh, were you trying to do the... What are you trying to do? Are oh, you trying to jump into the cannon? <laughs> I, f I tried that at first, but no, uh, there's like, you can't do that, unfortunately. I did it one time. Mm. You would assume that, though. Like, there's a lot of things in Banjo Kazooie and that that you think you can go into, but you can't. But yeah, you, you just learn it over time. Oh, great. What does she want now? When I'm nice and slim once more, burgers, fries, and chips galore. Wrong way. <laughs> gotcha. Uh, she has a healthy diet, doesn't she? Yes. Brilliant. Oh great, oh you found these things. I'm a red feather! I help Kazooie fly when she knows how. I don't know why it went from posh to like, just normal then. <laughs> oh no. I don't know man, my voice just does really weird things from time to time. There you go. Yeah. You can collect those, I, I would recommend it actually, because you might need a couple of those, to, considering like this is your first time playing as well. Yeah, I'm just playing around, figuring out. Yeah. What I can as I do it. Alright, cool. <laughs> so I'm just gonna look around the chest, make sure there's no secrets. Mm -hmm. Doesn't seem to be, so I'll just hop in the way I do. Yep, okay, ready? Hop in the way I do. <laughs> I failed. <laughs> hop in the way I do. Cool, there we go. Now we're actually in the world and 14 minutes in. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, cool. I, I might cut that down a bit. <laughs> Remember uh, about the notes and stuff. Collect all you can and don't die. Yep. Don't walk out the level. <laughs> <laughs> the Whoops. notes have already reached there. Now, <laughs> now Bottles is going to tell you your highest score is four notes. <laughs> 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 yeah, look, see, wow, your best note score for this round. <laughs> uh, I can't believe <laughs> I did that. Oh, well done. <laughs> He's actually, he might tell you there. Actually, he says, ahoy there, this be Treasure Trove Cove. There be two new moves for ye to find. Oh, uh, great. So we've got the pirate dialogue. I don't know what dialogue does that, by the way. Like it... Wow! I figured that out in, like, a few minutes flat. Yeah, yeah, actually. Uh, yeah, yeah you've got the hang of, like, the combat for the enemies, that's for sure. <laughs> Even though uh, somehow, like, so sure. earlier. <laughs> yeah. Okay, right. Oh, okay. Oh, well uh, spotted. Good one. You found the ginger at the beginning. Oh, careful of that guy. Snacker smells tasty dinner. Stay just there. Uh oh. <laughs> Screw you, shark. Okay. Uh, is it gone? Yeah, it's gone. It's gone. Okay. So know how does I die again? You'll know. Um, B. You, yeah. you, that's Z. <laughs> you know if it's coming. Um, when you hear the music and it tries to get you. Yeah. Uh, I try to collect him with you, me, him behind me. Yeah, it's a bit finicky in places. Like I said, the swimming controls in Badge Kazooie is very. Eh. Yeah. They fixed that completely in Tui, by the way. Oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. The reason why I'm trying to dive is because I want to get in quick. Oh, cool, you get it. Quick. And now just swim away. Yep. Although I think it's glitched so that it's still on my water one. Whoa, careful. He's like, <laughs> yeah, I was going to say. He's, he was like right on my butt. You want to jump and stuff. Yeah, that's cool. Cool, yeah. anyways. So, what are you going to begin in this world? I'm just going to do my thing and 
find out. What yeah, to do. that's that's the good thing about Banjo Kazooie. It's like you can do anything in any order you wish most of the time. So everyone's playthrough is going to be different. Yeah. You know, it's fun just to see like what routes they take and their strategies. Because some of it can be ideal for speed running. Yeah. Um. <clears throat> hello, bottles. Tell uh, me how to do this. That thing. <laughs> I'll look into it later. Whoa! I didn't see you for a sec there. I forgot the name of that guy, actually. Uh, uh, um. He'll probably tell you it in a bit or so. Bye! <laughs> I would rather not fight that thing. That song I tend to sometimes play when there's bloopers going on, by the way, when you fight that thing. Oh, that's it, cool. It's just got that sort of saxophone and trombone that sounds really suitable for bloopers. <laughs> <laughs> that, uh, and I'm just weird. <laughs> have you seen my copyright music? The copyright music? Um, when when something gets copyrighted, I put a certain song. <laughs> you put the what, sorry? I put a certain song when uh, something gets copyrighted. Oh, what one? Or like a, mis a dumb mistake. Is it, go um, what's it called? That song from Goof Troop. No, it's something from Angelica. <laughs> oh, oh There's yes, the fail song from yeah, Angelica. Yeah, yeah, the fail song. Whenever you feel on to totally Angelica for the PS One. Yeah. Yes, yes. Now I remember. I've never played Totally Angelica. Uh, Angelica. By well, me. it's really short, and it's not the best. I've seen Kedo Chris's video on it. Which was like. If you want to yes. try it, we can do a let's play on it. Oh, sorry. <laughs> That's okay. This is your big change, chicken legs. It's time for you to fly. Finally doing chicken run. At last. It better be easy, bog eyes. Simple enough even for you, bird brain. <laughs> There's a dialogue like that. Just stand on a flying disc and press A. Here's 25 red feathers to help you into the air. <laughs> Thanks. The, the, because the text goes by really slow, you can not hold down A to speed up, but it's just really awkward. Yeah. Half the time. And, oh. Um. Oh, right, yeah. You know the thing you saw in the background? Yeah. Uh, to, the, to the left or the right or whatever way is, you'll see like this sort of strange mountain over there. Wait. That's only here. Uh, that thing over there, you see it? No, no, no. Go to the right again. Right again. Ah, oh, there. Yeah, you yeah. see that? That's actually uh, an island that spawns when you do secret codes in the game. And for some oh. reason, it keeps it on the actual cartridge. I've done it before and it does it on every save file. Ah. See, on the actual game, when you play it, you know, raw, as in like you've never, you know, played the game in your life, yeah. the cartridge is being started new and fresh. Um, that island there doesn't appear and you have to do like this certain code inside the sand castle which unlocks extra content for you to collect eggs. Uh. But that's the reason why it's there. I was a bit confused for a second. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so you don't have to worry about it, by the way, because that's just like an extra thing you can do, which was supposed to be used with banjo Tui, but certainly it wasn't used. Just, um, you just fell off the ship. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. There you go. Cool. Well, I was trying to do what he told me, which was to press B on the disc, which I did, but Pre it was like, no. Nope. Press B on the disc? Did I say press B? I think you did, yeah. Sorry, I meant press A. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Stand on the flying disc and press A. I must have like misread it or something. Oh, this is Captain Blubber. Oh, he looks so sad. Yeah, and he's, he's burping. Yeah, his dialogue is through burping. It's hilarious. And if you hold down A, it sounds really funny because it's sped up burping. Well, I think he's he's um. Mm. Uh, who is it? I'm thinking of. Harry, your uh, laptop is about to die. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know who that reminds me of now? Uh, Nintendo Crap Reset. <laughs> Don't you want to say, like, what happened? <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> uh, my laptop was like, fuck me, help me. I was gonna say, like, we've just done a cut, but people want to know, wait, why'd you cut? What happened? <laughs> you just cut, and then you just went on to a normal conversation. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not very good at commenting. It's okay. Hello! It's just, I was like, what? <laughs> the audience have just seen, like, a thing going on. Okay, anyway, yeah. Yeah. Cool. So that guy is upset because um something about gold. Yeah, he Doesn't can't. It, like he can't swim to the bottom of the sea, so he can't get his gold from he, the bottom of the ship or something like that. Yeah, he can't find his gold, to be honest. And the gold speaks as well. <laughs> yeah, makes sense. This game also, is just great. <laughs> there's something I wanted to talk about that I noticed, but I didn't talk about. Mm -hmm. Um, I saw the crystal skull or whatever it's called. Um. I need better camera. Um, can I change camera in here or not really? Nah, it's fixed sadly. <laughs> That's so annoying. <laughs> There's many moments of this game where it's fixed. This is the 90s. Yeah, <laughs> I know. I wish I could look around though so I could actually figure out. Well, I'll do the Remember to hold story. down the A if you're having trouble in that. 
Uh, stay, there you go, yeah. Now I get back up. Yep, that's So it. that I can get some air. You were saying something about the crystal skull. Yeah, I saw a crystal skull underneath the cell bit where you have to fly. Yes. I saw... Do you know how to get uh, that? Yeah, fly around <laughs> and get it. Yeah. Or, uh, wait, are you on about underneath the actual uh, standing bit you were on? Yeah. No, actually, there's an easier way to get it. Uh, I'll look you'll, into it. Yeah, you'll find it out. I won't tell you exactly what to do. Ah, try to see if you can find out how to get out of here. I think it's pretty simple. Oh. No, wrong one! No, <laughs> you clicked the wrong button again! I, I, I always do that for some reason. That's okay, there you go, yeah. That's how you get out. Well done, you found like one bit of the gold, so that's cool. Yes, I gotta get to the other side. Oh, you did it by doing... Oh, you did that one first, okay, cool. Yeah, cool, so you found one of them. It said half all me gold. So you need to find the other piece now. And you've already found it. Well, done. <laughs> <laughs> well I could sort of tell it was going to be somewhere around the ship. Yeah, because like you could see it, you know, through the gates, yeah. showing you like the other gold. So you assume like it's somewhere around like the other side or something. Yeah, I'm gonna. I want to get these notes. Yeah, make sure you collect all of them. Yeah. There you go. And then, wait, I, how did I miss that? I was like right there. Yeah, uh, kinda. Just watch the shadow. I, I, I have bad sense of uh, what's it called? Perception? Yeah, I have bad perception. Oh, no, they call it, uh, this What's it called? Uh, sense of depth, I think they call it. I don't know. I don't remember. I can't remember either. <laughs> I <laughs> need to go great? down. Yes, just indeed. To down collect down it. There. there you go. You got it. Cool. I think that's it, isn't it? Uh. Bong, bong, I love how his nose just pokes up. <laughs> yeah, it's very pokes cute. Up the water. Yeah, this is a very charming game. There Even in places it can be a bit disturbing. Banjo 2 is very disturbing. Oh well. <laughs> <laughs> I have no clue what episode we're on because I don't know how I'm going to cut it up. This is episode uh, probably. It's 3 or 4, I'd say. I'd say it's probably. um No, not 3 or 4. I think it's uh, 4 or 5. Cause we Maybe. Did, I think we did 3 episodes like. You know, when we did from the beginning up to Mumbo's Mountain? Yeah. I think it was that anyway. Also, dude, you found like he's gold. <laughs> but I wanna explore. Okay. No, it's okay. Like, I'm just like saying that you don't have to literally do the directions I tell you and that's just I, I thought you forgot or something. <laughs> no, I'm alright. That's I'm just, okay. I'm just gonna get these. Mm-hmm. Ah, uh, okay, we're getting the gold. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm starting up there, but I can't see it. I'll, I'm going to swing over here, and then mm -hmm. look at the camera over right here to see what it is. Oh, that's what the... What the heck is that thing? That's Logo. Just yeah. Logo the bucket. You'll find out what he's for later. Bye. <laughs> uh, I don't need the honeycomb thing right now. No. Nah. Hello, treasure chest. Bye, treasure chest. With... <laughs> Clam is trying to eat me for some reason. <laughs> um, yeah. I'm here for you, sir. Yeah, that's I'm it. I'm gonna gonna bring you your your gold. <laughs> I think I figured out. So I got you gold. Yeah, he just does it for you when you do it. There you go. Cool. Me that... treasures. Thank you, me. Parties, take this reward. <laughs> Parties. <laughs> you went from pirate to just a casual American. <laughs> Thank you, me hearties. <laughs> yeah, that's fair enough. Cool. Yeah, yeah you know. I figured it out. You figured it out. Like. I, I pretty much just remembered that I could climb stuff in this game, and then I was like, oh, that's how I do it. Yeah. When else do you want to, um, you know, stop this episode or so? Because it's gone on for like 26 minutes so far. Uh. I might. Uh, it's up to you now. I think we'll do like one more puzzle and then call it. Oh, okay. What do you reckon? <laughs> yeah, we'll call it from there also because you want to make sure that even though we're recording this, you want to make sure you actually finish the world because otherwise, like I said, the notes reset. Yeah, we're, we're just gonna pause the recording, render it, or even not even do that, just end it and then. Just just continue on. <laughs> I yeah. don't know. It's a shame that honestly the N64 didn't have save states because, um, well, I mean, I'm alright playing this game the way it is, but it's really annoying if you're trying to record it. Yeah. Because it means you have to finish the world if you want, if you don't want to have to redo stuff. 
Yeah, that, that's what we're planning on doing, just not resetting the world and stuff. Exactly. Oh, uh, this is Red X here. Mm-hmm. Oh, you're doing this one first. Follow the climb if you look for gold. Yeah, that's it. Mm -hmm. Follow the clues if you're looking for gold. I thought it said Whoa, if okay. you're looking good. Ah, uh, yeah, you're using the flying. To fly higher, you'll need some red feathers. Uh, press A to use one. <laughs> but remember that Beaky can only carry 50 of them. You want to click the A button to float higher. Okay, <laughs> so I'm guessing I did that wrong. But I did get here faster, so... Mm-hmm. Uh, okay. Yeah, good one. <laughs> I was gonna say maybe not, but <laughs> you have an extra life. Extra lives don't really do much in this game, to be honest. Well, I just kind of fell in an awkward place. Yeah, you fell. If you find the camera's a bit too zoomed in, press the down button on the C button to zoom out. Yeah. Because you're very zoomed in at the minute. You're zoom almost, out. It's almost like trying to play Mario 64 with the R button. Okay, right. Sorry, just let me do that. There okay. you go, yeah. So, what is it? Zoom out? Uh, down C button. There you there go. go. And do it again. There you go. Yeah, because he was very zoomed in. You know, like a Mario 64? When yeah. you press the R button, it goes right into him. And I cannot play Mario 64 like that. Maybe I should do a challenge like that. Maybe. <laughs> Try oh, to beat Mario 64 in that blooming camera angle. <laughs> yes, that would be very difficult. So, I can't do anything with this yet. No, not uh, yet. you got to find a certain guy for that. I think you already know who it is, though. <laughs> Pretty much Bubbles, or whatever his name is. Bottles. Bottles. Yeah. <laughs> yes, i got to find him somewhere. Mm-hmm. Okay. In this level, I'm assuming. I'm going to just get up to 50 so that yep. it's a bit easier. Oh, ah, so yeah. Scott. Yeah. I was waiting for you to do that. I was like, are you going to go into the centre? <laughs> I was like, no, I'm oh, not going to go into the centre. I'm blow up. <laughs> <laughs> Harry, that's a mine. Mines explode. Don't I touch know it. this. <laughs> I know this. <laughs> I, I totally know this, right? <laughs> oh, um, also you have like one uh, honeycomb. Of yeah, the I'll go get the honeycomb thing in a minute. Because mm -hmm. I need it. I would be very careful. Yes. Okay, cool. You got four ecombokums. That's nice. Okay, so where is one close by? Do you know where is like something close by? Oh, what, well, for to replenish your health? Yeah, there's one over there. Didn't you see it? I'm not sure I did, huh? Ah, uh, there you are. Yeah, you know, I thought I saw one around here, but I didn't mm -hmm. remember where. They always have them at convenient places. Yes, it's good because I am not very good at platforming. Mm. It's it's weird to find, you know, that the people who made this are the same people who made Conker's Bad Fur Day. Yes. <laughs> like, what the hell? It's a bit of a... Is this guy going to kill me if I jump in into him? Um, no. You just make sure you jump and don't hit the spikes. Well... First off, don't do it like that. Yeah, yeah. Z uh, and A. Okay. Uh, I think you want to do it. I want to try and get as close as I can. And mm -hmm. then I've got to wait for him to open again. Mm -hmm. Don't get too close, though. Good one. In there, you'll get just a whole bunch of eggs. Oh. <laughs> and then I do the same, it is, right? it is worth it, though, because there are times where you have to make sure you have plenty of eggs, because you'll have to use them a lot yeah. later on in the game. Okay. I don't think there's actually... I think they probably do have a name, because they show it at the credits. But I can never remember that thing's name. Yeah. So, some things I remember, some things I don't. It happens. Yeah, exactly. Alright, cool. Okay. Oh, I said it was going to end it after the episode. Uh, so, we'll call it off here. Thank you for watching this episode of Banjo-Kazooie Co-op play thing <laughs> uh, <laughs> see you in the next one bye see you guys <laughs> already yeah oh, I've yeah, got... yeah. <laughs> oh I didn't notice that before <laughs> <laughs> it's, it hasn't got the icon but it's got the red in it up going hello welcome back because it is your channel after all yes alright cool oh, oh hello welcome back to episode 4 English English <laughs> don't the one that's Dutch. not 100% <laughs> well, all the others are 100%, 100%.